With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, welcome to doubtnet. So we have a question here. The question says, what type of reduction method does the following reaction show? So we have been given a reaction, bessemer converter reaction of metallurgy of copper, and here the reaction is. Copper oxide and copper sulfide is being heated, and pure copper metal and sulfur dioxide are given as a product. So let us understand what is happening here. So let us rewrite the reaction that is given to us. We have been given a reaction: 2Cu2O plus Cu2S, and it is being heated, and six copper plus SO2 is being formed. See. That there was an oxide of copper here and sulfide of copper here, and we are getting pure copper. So what is happening here? The process that is happening here, that is, this one is being reduced, and this one is also being reduced. So this is known as auto reduction, auto reduction, or self reduction. so to understand this process you will have to understand the whole process now this is what is happening here it is the purification of copper ore for the formation of pure metal of copper so this reaction given to us is the middle reaction of the whole process i will explain you the whole process thoroughly now what happens here this bessemer converter reaction is a process used during the uh, conversion of copper ore to pure copper metal that is known as blister copper the copper produced in this reaction is known as blister copper so let us understand the whole process so for the purification of copper ore what happens copper ore is present in the form of sulfides so primarily what happens that in the first step in in the presence of air in presence of air in presence of air copper ore is heated so what happens there is ore of ore of copper which is cu2s it is heated in the presence of air so oxygen is present so a part of this ore is converted to oxide of copper that is cu2o and we also get copper sulfide here so only a part is converted this copper sulfide some part is converted to copper oxide so if we balance this reaction here this we get oxygen here so this one here is so partially converted to oxide now this process is carried out with less electropositive metals like this process is carried out you must know this this process is done with less electropositive metals like copper mercury and lead now after this process what happens this partially converted sulfide ore after this process this partially converted sulfide ore partially converted partially converted into what into oxide sulfide ore is heated in absence of air in absence of air the reaction they have given you is this part that is here now what happens this partially converted oxide is taken that is cu2o and this remaining sulfide is taken so and now what we get here is pure copper that is given to us in the reaction and sulfur dioxide is evolved here so 
the reaction given to us in the question is this reaction which is the second reaction of this procedure the final reaction of bisomerization of copper so this one is final reaction of bisomerization bisomerization of copper so in this process we see that reduction of both the oxide and the sulfide of copper is taking place so this process is thus termed as self reduction or auto reduction auto reduction or self reduction because no external agent has been used two types of copper compound are used here so this is known as auto reduction so your answer to the question in the question you have been asked what type of reduction so the answer is the answer you can write here is the process called auto reduction or self reduction so i have explained you the whole process that is occurring here so that you can understand the concept of self reduction since the reaction given to you was a middle reaction of a process so i have taught you the whole process also what is bisomerization of copper and how it is done the first part we do in the aerobic atmosphere that is in the presence of oxygen to convert the sulfide ore partially to oxide so that there are both oxide and sulfide ores after which self reduction is carried out to give pure copper which is known as blister copper i have told you before also blister copper and so2 is given out so this is the whole procedure i hope you have understood all the points well thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today